Are you disobeying a direct command, Private? You were told to leave! Okay! We're out of here! Clerk Vazemir! Hi, Private Aaron! Wow! You all managed to get dressed today! I'm still in my... Well, uh, it's nice seeing you. I'd better get back to my office and finish, uh, finish eating my french fries. Wait a sec, clerk. You're the colonel's secretary. You know everything that happens around here, don't you? I do. Great. Just the man we want to speak to. Tell us, clerk. What exactly is going on? Ahem. <clears throat> Uh, gotta run. My french fries are getting cold. Clerk? All right, all right. You won't give up, will you, boys? Come into my office, and I'll explain everything. <sighs> At least we still have fries. Anyone want? No, thanks. We're more interested in understanding why everyone is so down in the dumps. You see that boat? It looks massive. That's the Lulavite. Sure is. I mean, sure was. Last week, as the Lulavite was making its way across the sea, a major storm hit. The crew managed to get off in time, but all the cargo is... is gone! <laughs> no! Huh? huh? You're telling me that everyone's sad because some stuff's drowned in the sea? Really? You don't get it, guys. It's not just some stuff. That boat carries the Arba Minim for all of Yidenberg. I'll make a list for you of all the problems. No Lulav, no Esrig, no Hadassim, no Aravis. Without that shipment, nobody here is going to have Arba Minim for Sukkis. Is it really such a big deal that- Don't finish that sentence. Of course, it's a big, massive, terrible deal. And now, we can't do one of the mitzvahs of Sukkis the way our commander-in-chief wants. Clerk, are those Panama Panamers? Yeah, why? You want one? I'd love to be able to talk to my parents and sister and tell them that I'm alright. Can I take one? Does it work? Does it work? Of course it works. I designed it. You're the technician here? Yeah, that makes sense. Wait, you are the tech guy? I never knew that. That's awesome. Hi. I built all of it to help us serve Hashem better. But if it can't help us with our Arba Minim problem, it's all completely worthless. All the tech in Yittenberg is failing right now. But I just can't. No. I have no energy to do any fixing. All I can do is sit here and cry and eat pizza. And fries. Mendel. Clerk, the broken portal, you can fix that? I technically could, but didn't you just hear me, Private? Right now, I can't do much of anything. <laughs> I think it's time to go, guys. Uh, don't worry, Clerk. Uh, we'll sort out this mess. Mendel, we were so worried. We had no idea if the portal sent you to outer space or who knows where. Yeah, sorry about that. But don't worry about us, Rachel. Worry about Yiddenberg. Yom Kippur was nice here, but Sukkis is going to be a disaster. They won't have Abra Minim, and they're so upset that they won't be able to celebrate this Yom Tif the way the Commander-in-Chief wants. But that's crazy. Hashem doesn't want us to sit around all sad. The mitzvah of Sukkis is to be happy. In the tag, what the Rebbe the Ezek leaving, Faz Masnim Choseinu, you're right, Rachel. Boys, it's up to you. Figure out some way to cheer the place up before Sukkis comes around. Right, there's a lot more to be happy about on Sukkis. Especially in Yiddenburg. I bet you have a lot of things... All right, I just realized. The military victory parade. Oh, no! Huh? I don't get it. What's the big deal? So there won't be a parade this year? Ari, you're only speaking like this because you've never seen the parade before. It's magnificent, and more than that, it's a sign of our victory. It's a sign that the Commander-in-Chief is happy with all the work we've been doing over Tishrei. All the soldiers march, everyone, and there's food and dances and floats and the weapon parade. Weapon parade? Which weapons do you march with? Is that even safe? <laughs> 
Very safe, you'll see. This is what I want you to see. Rifle! Alright, this is no rifle. It's a lulav. And if this is a bullet, I'm a banana. This is an esterg. Thank <laughs> you.